Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to turn on your computer's firewall on your Mac OS device, specifically Mac OS Big Sur. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So we are going to start off by opening up System Preferences down in our System Dock. So you want to go ahead and just left click on that button to System Preferences when you hover over it. So go ahead and left click on that. Select the Security and Privacy button. You will more likely be landed on the General tab here, but you want to go ahead and select the Firewall. And then you're going to have to go click the Lock to make changes down here. So go ahead and left click on that. Enter in an Administrator Password and select Unlock. Now you can go ahead and select Turn On Firewall and you can see the firewall is turned on and set up to prevent unauthorized applications, programs, and services from accepting incoming connections. Go ahead and select Firewall Options if you want to see additional options listed here. So if you want to block all incoming connections, let's say you just want to shut everything down for a moment, you can go ahead and check mark there. You can also customize the other options down here such as automatically allow built-in software to receive incoming connections which is very important in terms of just auto updating applications and whatnot could receive issues too if you're using Skype or other peer-to-peer -peer network connections or web browsers or just about anything you don't really want to turn that off and it says automatically allow downloaded signed software to receive incoming messages which is fine I wouldn't mess with that and then you also have stealth mode here or do not respond or acknowledge attempts to access this computer from the network by test applications. So I really, again, wouldn't mess with any of that. And if there are any connections you want to block, you can select the little plus button in here. And if there's any apps you want to block their connections or customize the connection options, you can go ahead and just select them from here. And then if you were to select the add button, you can go ahead and customize the options. So just for the example I chose for contacts, we have it set to allow incoming connections. But if I click the little arrow on the far right side of it, I could block all incoming connections as well. So you see have those options there. So again, pretty straightforward. And if you wanted to remove an item from the list, you could just left click on it and then select the minus button down here to remove it. So again, pretty straightforward process, guys. Do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.